I'm Derek Nichols, associate head coach. I got back here in 2012. I was a student and an athlete back in the mid-90s, played here in 96 and 97. Came back 2012 and uh, been here ever since. My name's Abby Gibson. I am like, gonna be a senior this year, and I play center mid here at UCA. Oh, do we take a bite? Yeah. This is my lunch. <laughs> you already getting a drink? Yeah, just two. Yeah. You ready? Mm -hmm. So what were some of the reasons you chose UCA? Well, when I first came here, when I was like 15, I really enjoyed the campus and the, it's more like a small college feel, not too small, but not too big either. And the team, like when I met with some of the girls on the team, were all super friendly and nice. And I think my favorite part about coming to UCA before, like learning about it before I came was definitely the team feel. Everyone was like family. So that's what I would say. Good. Yeah. Next. Mm -hmm. What's been your favorite moment as a coach at UCA? Well, I'd have to say since coming back in 2012 and being able to, you know, kind of progress the program where we thought we could, um, obviously won in three championships in the last six years. So 2016 being the first one, 2018, and then of course last year, um, 2021 being the first ASUN Co-West Champs was, was pretty cool. Yeah, I'd say that's my favorite season too. I bet so. Mm -hmm. Next bite. Oh, so this one's getting a little hotter. Are you scared? No, it's not bad, bad yet. Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay. Starting to get a little bit of heat. Not bad, but you can start. Mm -hmm. Starting to feel it. You need milk? Not yet. I don't need the milk yet. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be trouble. <laughs> yeah, you ready? Mm -hmm. So what are your goals for after college? Well, as of right now, I, my major, I'm majoring in communication sciences and disorders, and I plan on going to grad school for speech language pathology after this year. But I do have a COVID year, but we don't know yet. I'm planning on going to grad school next year, though, but it's still up in the air. Or coming back and playing one more year. Potentially. We'll see. We'll see. You never know. Or going on to play pro. Either one. Maybe. Yes. All options on the table. Yeah, I'm keeping keeping the options open. Awesome. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> Starting to warm up. Mm. <sighs> mm -hmm. It's a big one. Yeah. This is where it's going to start getting scary. Whew. I think it's not that bad. Feeling it, yeah. I'm starting to sweat. Are you? Maybe, maybe I'm just nervous. I haven't got that one yet. I haven't got the sweats yet. I'm sure it's coming. Mm. Now it's starting to starting to get warm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> starting to get warm. So. What, what qualities does it take to be a soccer player here at UCA? Ooh, good question, good question. You know, we're just looking for individuals that are willing to come in and work extremely hard. Um, being able to get on the, the same page that we're trying to do is come in and compete for championships year in and year out. People that are willing to put in the work to get there. Um, obviously individuals that are gonna be, um, they're ready to come in and, and get work done in the classroom on and off the field. Um, but having a good time, enjoying what we're doing, and competing for championships every single year. Yeah. What are your thoughts on that? You tell me. I feel like you guys bring in people who work hard and like who also are like, I don't know, they work hard, but we can balance school and soccer and life too. Like we get to have a college experience too. But I think soccer has been really fun and we work hard and we win, so. You do it all. Good combo. Great combo. That's why I chose UCA. There you go. And it's getting hot, folks. It's starting to warm up in here. Mm. <clears throat> <clears throat> Ooh. 
Ready for the next one? Uh oh. So this is it, huh? This is it. Oh boy. Here we go. How many bites you take there, Gibby? What? How big of it? That's pretty big. It's a solid, it's a solid bite. All right. It's pretty, pretty hot. Mm. <laughs> what kind of bites did you take? Mm. No, it's about half. That's a weenie bite. Yeah, no, it's about half. Good. Mm. It might take a minute to sit in. My mouth is already on fire, so it'll be a little harder to get all the way through. Mm. But I am feeling it. You are sweating a bit, Gib. Yeah, mm. thanks for letting me know. <laughs> I feel like it's, I expect it worse. Well, it just usually takes a while to kick in. Mm. I think it's doing its job. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> it's starting to get there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> okay. So, explain to me uh, in detail the perfect penalty kick. Uh, I would just say just one straight to the corner, low corner. Cool, calm, and collected. Just walk up, hit it to the corner. No need to do anything extra, just hit it low into the corners. I feel like that's the hardest to save. What about your approach? My approach? Yeah. I mean, are you, are well, you looking at the keeper? Are you looking down? Are you trying to trick the keeper? I feel like I look at the keeper because I don't want to look in the corners or which way I'm going to go. I also don't like line up. I wouldn't line up like to the left, like to show that I'm shooting with my right foot. You, you run know? straight on? Yeah, I try to a little bit. I feel like I would hit it. It's a safe option to hit it with inside your foot, but I feel like laces. Is the laces way to go. of power is good. Yeah. On frame is always good. Mm -hmm. My mouth is getting really hot. <laughs> yeah, I'm still sweating, so. <coughs> Woo, okay. <sighs> <All right. laughs> what would you do back in, back in your day whenever you would uh, hit a PK at UCA? It was, uh, I'm a lefty, mm. so I do come off, open up, and I, I usually always went to my left, open up, side foot. Yeah, yeah. I think but, I would go to my right too. Yeah. As I get older, I think it's a little more power. I don't have enough in me to be as accurate, so I gotta get a little more power these days. And I can hit it pretty hard. These days. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, when my mouth's not on fire. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, the water's not really helping. Yeah, it keeps getting hotter. How is it happening? Yeah, I'm still sweating. Okay. <sighs> How do you perform a perfect sliding tackle? <laughs> well, you should know. <laughs> I do it every day in training. No, no, no. no. Yeah, I just kidding. pulled a, a quad doing that. So. Uh, I've pulled a few things over the years, unfortunately. It's a little bit harder as you get older. Um, but the perfect tackle, it's all, it's all about timing, right? It's all about timing. So you got to get in, see it as it comes off, ready, get in, slide all the way through it. And obviously, if it's in training and it's one of our players, you got to go easy. But in a match, yeah. no, it's all in, all in. Right, right, right. How about yourself? Um, mm. A perfect slide tackle, I would say, is like they're ahead of you, like running and coming from behind. Ooh, but you can't do it from behind. Well, not from behind, no. not sliding from behind. Not from but behind. But like, they're like, you yes, know, and then you come yeah. around and then slide tackle. Yeah. You, you, did you do a lot of sliding tackles in your... I was not much of a slide tackler, no. I was more of a, give the ball to my feet, I will give it to somebody else, mm -hmm. and then I would let the defenders take them off the ball. Yeah. I was not much of a power guy. You want to start around a little bit, give me. Woo! <laughs> you play left back or goalie? No, no yeah, I was definitely not goalie. I was, uh, well, I started out as a forward mm. in high school and then moved back into midfield, central midfield, and then because of the left foot, I moved out wide left. Mm. Man, this is really hot. <laughs> yeah, my lips kind of hurt. I feel like my esophagus is on fire. Your esophagus? <laughs> Woo! Mm. Kid. I need a God. minute. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it just keeps getting hotter. This is unbelievable. It wasn't too bad at first, but it keeps getting hotter. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you, everyone, for joining us on Bear Talks. Our season is coming up quick, and our first game is at Missouri State, and our first home game is August 25th against Little Rock. We hope to see everyone there. Bear Claws up. Go Bears. Some good outtakes there, probably good. Yeah, probably. That was good work.
holy cow. I mean, I can't imagine. That was one bite. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I can't imagine doing the entire thing.